<clears throat> and can you hear me? Howdy ho, everybody. Hey, Tawny. Hello again. Thank you for joining us here. I'm sure we will have some other folks joining us as well. In our latest RuneScape stream here at the Rocks Roost. It is 1 o'clock. Um, you know, I've just noticed something really interesting. I have one of those Nintendo... Legend of Zelda Game & Watch um, things sitting here on my desk that I use for a clock. I use it for a desk clock. It's plugged in all the time. And uh, it's actually lost about 40 seconds of time in the past day or so. It was exactly correct yesterday, and now it is not. That's weird. Anyhow, who knows? It's uh, We don't buy these things for their accuracy. All right, so let me see. What were we doing? We were doing... We were questing, right? I think we needed to go kill wolves. Uh, he's going to say... He's still on assignment. Kill the wolves. Kill the wolves. Okay. So, wolves. I had planned on playing this on my own time yesterday... But um, I, I didn't get a chance to. It, it, it was kind of crazy here yesterday um, at another house uh, that I have up the road. There were some termites that showed up there. I had to go take care of that. And uh, that was just, uh, you know, super fun. So where am I going to get these wolves, I wonder? Do you have any ideas, Tawny? Also, what do I have the latency set on for this? I have it on ultra low. Okay. So that should reduce the, uh, the lag. I'll spit it out in a minute. Very close. Okay. So you're here too. I'm standing right next to the lodestone. Are you here somewhere? So we gotta go find these wolves and eliminate them. And the bank. Okay. Oh, I, I see ya. I see you there. Uh, you're you're in uh, brown. I'm I'm standing right behind you. So if you like, we could go hunt for some wolves when you're ready. The thing. Ever since I got my new graphics card. Hey, Philippe! 
Good to see you, my friend. Welcome to the stream. Well, we're getting ready to go kill some wolves, I think. Are you ready, Tawny? You want? I'm going to follow you. So if you want to go and uh, to where the wolves are. Okay. I got it all set. Yeah, so we're getting ready to go hunt down some wolves. What's new with you, Philippe? Another day. Good. Glad to hear it, my friend. I hope you'll be able to join us for the Fallout stream tomorrow night at 8 p.m. Eastern. I'm going to be doing New Vegas. Ah, oh, it won't let me go down the wall, the well. But I think here. Oh, you fell in. Oh, <laughs> that's funny. Yeah, good, 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 good. I'm going to talk about the TV show. Did you watch it, Philippe? Here's the wolf. Sorry, Tony, you fell in the well. That's a bummer. We got to get rid of 15 of these wolves. Okay, Tony, I'll do that. These adolescent white wolves. This is the strongest monster I've encountered that wasn't a boss so far. If you don't count the giant mole that just owned me. And you know what? I Now I've got some food. I need to cook some of this stuff. Because I don't have a whole lot of food. Well, Philippe, uh, there will be some spoilers. Well, we'll see how it goes. I'd planned on talking about the show. So, there may very well be some spoilers. You got rank 5 in the range skill. That's good. I don't have room for any of this. It's fine. I need to eat. Yeah. Is not recommended at this. You'll find more benefit from short. But okay, well, good to know. So I need to go back to the bank. Well, I'm really looking forward to it. I re like I said, I started it years ago, and just got busy with life. I'm gonna have to go back to the bank, Tony, and get my short bow. Wait, 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 wait. Well, maybe I'm. Maybe I don't. I think I have it. Wait a minute. Uh, I didn't realize I was using a bad bow for my... Oh, remove it. Oh, I don't have a string? Are you kidding? Hmm. Is there a bank near the mountain? Is this it? Oh, it is. Thank you. Bank counter. Now, I have a... Yeah, I have a bow that is strung already. Okay. So we don't need this. If it's not strung, I'm going to put this in. Let me put everything in that I'm not using. Here's a question. Oh, you killed the mole this morning. Good, Tony. Congrats. I should say I will only be streaming for about an hour today because I have um, to take care of that pest situation again. I need to work on that some. Uh, here's a question. Oops. Here's a question. Uh, where is a convenient place to cook some of this meat? Because... If I try to cook it on a campfire, I'm sure I will ruin it. Oh, over fire? Okay. Well, okay. <laughs> I guess that's that's a good question, a good answer. At the stove. Okay. 
Well, I'm going to need to... Uh, why am I having so much trouble here? I'm going to need to do that, because I don't have a lot of food ready. There is a stove across the road from the bank. Okay. Hmm. Hey, Robert. Good to see you. Yeah, I'm so glad you could make it. I knew you would eventually. <laughs> Whenever you can, I always appreciate you being here. I'm going to go back up to Birdthorpe. And uh, no worries, Tony. Woohoo is right, my friend. So there's a stove. The stove is across from the bank. Is it like this way across from the bank? All right, so oh, here it is. Cooking, cooking. First of all, I'm going to cook some of this food. Thanks, Tony. And I'm going to then go back up to the mountain and kill some wolves. I need to kill 14 more wolves. I'm on a, uh, I think it's called a Slayer Quest. Is that what they call it? And after that, we'll... I'm open to suggestions. Okay, Tawny, good luck. Thank you. Okay. Uh, for anyone who's interested, I'm in World 249. Cool. And I'm so very glad that you are here. Let's see. I, let me make sure I'm on 249. Yep. Yeah. I'm on World 249 if anybody wants to jump in with me. Not going to be doing anything super exciting, I, I don't guess, today. Just kind of chill. Poorly cooked bird meat. Well, isn't that the story of my life? Burnt chicken. Isn't this nice? I burned some of my food. I just definitely need to up. Uh, raise my level, you know, of this here cooking. Anywho, I guess I could just uh, throw this on the ground. Is that is littering? Oh well, we'll say this is composting. Uh, drop. Level Slayer while wow, leveling combat. Okay. All right. Good, good, good. So I, I don't want to break any, uh, uh, what, what's the word? Like, um, taboos. <laughs> Anywho. Okay, Robert, that'll be good to see you. Let me see if I can get back down here. There we go. I hope I have enough arrows. And why am I doing this with ranged? Well, I mean, why not? I, I, I do need to increase my skill level in all of the... Um, I don't want to chop down the every... All of the combat types. At least that's my understanding, anyway. All right, here we go. Well, I may not be, Tawny. Because I'm definitely not a member yet. Okay, shoot. Shoot. Well, the damage is very low. And, um... Will I automatically eat when I need to? I don't know. I guess we'll see. I'll keep an eye on the backpack. These wolves are uh, crazy. HP, how's it going, my friend? Good to see you. I have to eat. Okay. I will do that. When it's needed, of course. I love how we're um, 
you know, shooting this wolf directly in the face while we're immediately adjacent to it. It's not, it's not for me to question, right? Okay. So. Let's go attack another one. That went okay. It has been a while. No, don't chuck down the tree. Attack the wolf. There we go. There we go. Yeah, it's been a while. It's good to be back. Don't forget, we have a Fallout stream tomorrow night at 8 p.m. For anyone who's interested, I don't want to talk about that too much because this is RuneScape's time, but I did want to mention that because uh, I, I know that you're, uh, you may be interested in that. HP. Well, that's a good point. That is a good point, my friend. Everything is a melee weapon if you use enough strength. True words have never been spoken. Yeah. I can indeed. Okay. These wolves. Uh, I'm, I'm assuming I'm getting pretty decent experience here. We got a level of uh, something. Combat ability bash. Nice. Let's get that. Cool. Well, I'll be glad to see you. It should be fun. All right. Let's eat the meat. Do a little bit of healing in there. And we can go after another wolf. Why not? Uh, this is a more respectable range, I think. Uh, oh, yeah. Shoot it. I assume... I'm assuming that, um, yeah, I am crushing it. And this one is staying, you know, at a, at a healthy range. But I don't know what's going on with your phone, HP. Maybe it's possessed. All right, can we just... Don't chop down the evergreen. We don't want wood at the moment. Let's get the stuff. And let's bury the bones. And let's take down another wolf. We're doing okay now. Oh, yeah. How are we doing on arrows, by the way? Um, I have not, Robert. As soon as I get this done, uh, get the wolf thing done, I guess I'll, uh, or can we start a, can we start a quest at any time? Because, uh, you know, I'm, you know, this, this is fun and all, but I'm not convinced that me just running around shooting wolves that take two or three minutes <laughs> to kill is the most exciting, uh, streaming content. Okay, uh, this is a MMORPG. It's free to try. And um, it is, um, well, it's very uh, many faceted. There, there's a lot of things you can do. You can um, fight, you can be a farmer, you can do um, archaeology. Um, you can do these random quests. You can you can do all kinds of things. So how does one go about getting a quest? That that's something that, if that was covered in the tutorial, I don't remember it. But yes, the HP. There's a tremendous amount of um, uh, depth of uh, 
content here. Okay, let's see. So there's a there's a menu for it. Adventures. Here we go. Quests. I got it. Get a video like Braxu. Going to Lumbridge to start. Okay, so let's um, talk to the cook in the kitchen of Lumbridge Castle. This is the very first one under Pathfinder. Um, I guess we can do that. Empty pot. Empty bucket. Okay. One quest point. The rewards. All right. Uh, this might be a good one. So let's do this. Let's set active. It's been marked on the map. Okay. What is this? Okay. The, the interface is the biggest um, hurdle to overcome. I, I'm sure once I get this, you know, down pat, I will... Uh, it'll, it'll be a no big deal for me, but I am... Uh, in my 40s, I I don't have the elasticity in my brain I once had, so it takes me a minute. Okay, so let's see. Let's go to the map. Here we go. So it says, start of Cook's Assistant, right here. How old is the game? Hmm. Well, there's two versions. There's old school RuneScape, which I think... Came out in 2001, I think. Is that right? And uh, this is actually RuneScape 3, I think is what it's called. It's kind of confusing. All right. Anyhow, let, let me... Uh, I'm sure that uh, both Robert and Tawny in the chat are very experienced with this game. And they could answer questions about it a whole lot more than I could. But I'm pretty sure I remember reading that the game came out in 01. So it's been around. Yeah, so... It's, it's, it's um, you know, pretty, pretty old. Oh, we have breadcrumbs. I like that. N normally, I don't like, you know, to be... Spoiled by waypoints and stuff, but uh, in, in this game is so overwhelming for me. Talk to the cook. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. What am I to do? Says the cook. What's wrong? Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. I'm in a terrible, terrible mess. It's the Duke's birthday today. And I should be making him a lovely big birthday cake using special ingredients. But I've forgotten to get the ingredient ingredients, even. I'll never get them in time. Now he'll sack me. Whatever will I do? I have four children and a goat to look after. <laughs> Would you help me, please? Yes, I will help you. So this um, is a pretty typical RPG screen. We're going to accept the quest. Oh, thank you, thank you. I must tell you that this is no ordinary cake, though. Only the best ingredients will do. I need a super large egg. Okay. If if y'all have watched any of my pre-recorded videos, you'll know that I have um, an obsession with eggs. As uh, Baldur's Gate 3 says in the tooltip, how frolicsome. Anyhow, top quality milk and some extra fine flour. Uh, where can I find those, then? Well, that's the problem. I don't exactly know. I usually send my assistants to get them for me. Or my assistant, rather. Uh, to get them for me, but he quit. Well, why did he quit? That's suspicious. I've marked some places on your world map in red. You might want to consider investigating them. Okay. Okay. 
He's marked some areas in red. Uh. <laughs> okay. Well, we need a bucket, right? It's not going to be super far away. Um. Let me see. Let me check something here. My goodness. There, there is so much stuff on this map. Uh, it's a good thing you can turn it on and off. Okay. Thank you, Robert. Okay, so we go here. No, we don't go here. We, this one, where the compass is. Adventures, quests. Here we go. Cook's assistant. I need to find the bucket of top quality milk, a pot of extra fine flour. Okay. Uh, set active, yeah. Uh, quest overview. All right, so I need to get um, a pot that can be found in a flour mill in an empty bucket near a dairy cow. So I need to get those things in order to get the bucket of milk and the pot of flour, right? I also need to find the big old egg. Well, he says he's marked areas on the map. I, I don't see him. But let's just walk around. I do have some trouble. I, I have a lot of trouble seeing, like, understanding where boundaries on the map are. So I'm assuming everything that's on the mini map right now in blue, that that is Lumbridge. Is that correct? Okay. North of Lumbridge, Tawny says. I'm sorry if I'm I'm like so elementary about this, but <laughs> again, I I uh, my plans to play the game on my own time yesterday were dashed. Okay, so I need to find a mill and some cows. They're marked on the minimap as you walk around. Okay, so, for instance, let's see. There's some red dots right here. Uh, no, that's not. Okay, so Tawny says head north for the egg and the flower. Uh, there's an egg. That's not a big egg. Oh, oh, there's a big egg. Super large egg. I see it. I gotta get in there somehow. Open gate. Can I just go in there and get me an egg? I hope this is not bad karma. Let talk to the farmer. Okay. I will do that. There's a security guard. Where is this farmer? Is the farmer going to be inside here? I tell you what. I tell you what. Let me open the gate. Let us let us uh, be logical about this, right? <laughs> hey, there he is. Oh, achievement. Wait, that's not a sheep. What? <laughs> what are you doing on my land? You're not the one who keeps leaving all my gates open and letting out all my chickens, are you? I'm looking for something to kill. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, well, I'm looking for work. Oh, well, I could do it with a bit of help since you're offering. And for some reason, this farmer is from Vermont. 
I need to collect some black wool from my sheep, and I'd be much obliged if you could share them for me. While you're at it, spin the wool in the walls for me, too. Does it have to be black wool? Has to be. I'm doing business for some guy after black clothing. Something to do with black looking cool? Okay. I'm going to have to drop the accent. It takes all sorts, I suppose. Well, well I mean, black, cool, black clothing is cool, right? If you, Especially, you know, if you're a goth. If you're into the goth scene. Uh, or the punk scene. Or just about any scene. I mean, whatever. It takes all sorts. I'm not going to get bogged down in the in the um um uh whatever anyhow indeed so if you bring me 20 balls of black wool i'm sure i could sort out some sort of payment so is this a quest no it isn't it's work you do it a say then you get paid okay so this is a mini quest okay so in true rpg fashion you get distracted left and right, and uh, that's fine. That's fine. That means there's always plenty to do. Okay, so uh, select. Okay, let's accept it. Let's accept it. Okay, so good. Hopefully, you'll be safe from the thing. What? Do you actually know how to shear a sheep? Of course. I see, Tony. Let me get through this sheep shearing thing. What, 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 what do you mean about the thing? Well, no one's ever seen the thing. That's why they call it the thing, because we don't know what it is, see? Some say it's a black-hearted shapeshifter, hungering for the souls of decent, hard-working folk like me. Others say it's just a sheep. Well, I don't have all day to stand around and gossip. Did you know? Did you say you knew how to shear sheep? I, I do, yes. We've done it before. Yes, I've done the spinning, yes. Uh, I'm something of an expert. I would not say that, but whatever. Well, stop grinning and get to work, then. <laughs> I'm not paying you by the hour. Okay. Bad accents aplenty. So now if I talk to him again... Hmm. So I guess I have to do this now. Can you tell me about the battlefield? Hmm, okay. Yeah, a great big portal appears not far from my farm, and Sarah Domin and Zamorak come traipsing over my land, happy as you please. Blooming soldiers everywhere, spooking my chickens, and telling everyone they should join up in some army or the other. Then without a warning, Sarah Domin himself plunks a wall camp on top of my house. Well, I was angry, I tell ya. <clears throat> the accent's getting old. So I left a sternly written letter with the Duke and built a new house. Bringing my sheep with me. Okay, and you know what? The thing followed. Okay. Well, I'll tell ya. Um, it feels good to know what I'm doing. Hey, Goatman, I'm sorry. I did not notice that you had uh, joined the stream. Thank you, my friend. Uh, good, good to have you. Hope you're doing okay. Um, no worries about being late. We're just kind of chilling out on a Saturday, you know. Uh, missionaries, uh, were you out spreading the good word or were you running them off with a broom handle? <laughs> Okay, so I'm guessing I got Cook's assistant. Didn't I get the egg? I mean, I thought I picked the egg up. Here I have it, super large egg. Okay, so um, I'll come back here and get these sheep later. Oh, there's a mill over here. Oh, look at this guy. Is that an NPC? Oh, okay. That's good. Well, you know, you never know. I enjoy a good, uh, 
Uh, I, I enjoy a little of the gospel spreading myself from time to time. But every now and then, some folks will show up that, uh, well, you know, I don't know. They, 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 they can be a little, uh, uh, a little entertaining. So here I am. I am at the well. An empty pot. I need this. I will. Here I am jumping the gun. I will talk to the lady at the mill. Hello, adventurer. Welcome to Mill Lane Mill. That's a little on the nose, isn't it? Can I help you? I am looking for extra fine flour. What's wrong with ordinary flour? Well, I'm no expert chef, but apparently it makes better cakes. This cake, you see, is for Duke Horacio. Really? How marvelous. Well, I can sure help you out there. Go ahead and use the mill, and I'll realign the millstones to produce extra fine flour. Anything else? How do I mill flour? Making flour is pretty easy. First of all, you need to get some wheat. You can pick some from the wheat fields. That's nice of you. There is just one. There is one just outside the mill. Sorry. Um, but there are many others scattered across the world. Ah, ice cream. What's your favorite flavor of ice cream? Chat, HP. What, what kind of ice cream do you have, HP? And what is your favorite? And then everybody in the chat, let me know your uh, favorite. Uh, feel free to pick wheat from our field. There always seems to be plenty of wheat there. And then I bring my wheat here? Yes. Or to one of the other mills in Gilinor. They all work the same way. The, see, it's like the nuclear power plants in France. It, it is uniform uh, operations, you know. Nice. We got some good ones there. Coffee. Tony likes coffee. Goatman likes strawberry. Uh, Tony also likes rum raisin. Pistachio HP. I have lemon I prefer. Well, I'll tell you something. Um... One of my favorites, I have one in the freezer right now that's uh, uh, Hendersonville, I think is the brand. It's a triple chocolate, uh, triple peanut butter cup. That's what it is. It's uh, pretty good. It's peanut butter ice cream with little ice cream, uh, little teeny peanut butter cups in it. Okay. All right. Put the, put the wheat in the hopper. Then you need to start the grinding process by pulling the lever near the hopper. You can add more wheat, but each time you add wheat, you'll be pulling the hopper level again. You know, vanilla, a really good vanilla is excellent. Is really excellent. So where does the flour go then? The flour appears in this room here. You need an empty pot to put the flour into, which we have. One pot will hold the flour made by one load of wheat. That's all there is to it, and you'll have a pot of flour. Gee, thanks for your help. All right, I'll be off now. Yes, ice cream, ice cream. Yeah, so a good vanilla is actually hard to beat. One of my favorites, uh, and I, I don't, I don't buy this brand anymore. But one of my favorites was Ben and Jerry's oatmeal cookie dough. So how much wheat do I need to get? I'm just going to get some. We have three. She may have told me, but... Just one. Okay. I had a feeling I may have been overdoing it. Alright. The hopper. Uh, the hopper? Am I... Okay, how stupid do I feel right now? Now, I'm, I'm going to... Obviously, I can't have ice cream right now. Oh! Silly. Thank you, Robert. I should have paid attention. Go up. Here we are. Investigate Hopper. Use the wheat. Okay. And it goes. All 
operate the controls. I may have some ice cream after the stream, though. I haven't had any in a few days, so... I can probably, uh... Why am I... I think I dropped one. Oh, whatever. Use the wheat on the hopper. Oh, one at a time. Oh, I see. I have to go down there. Oh, I see. I see. So I need to take this wheat. I'll get used to this, I swear. Use the wheat on the hopper. Pull the lever. Oh, it's not doing anything. Anyway, let's just go get our uh, wheat. This could be called screwing around the game. Go down the ladder, but only because I'm so inept at it. Take flour. So we now have extra fine flour in a pot. Okay, so we, we only needed to do one. So uh, I will... Um, I will, can you just drag? Yeah. I'll just throw that down right now. Okay. Now the milk. Go across the river, Tawny says. Okay. So to the east. I'll follow the path. There's a nice bunch of cabbages there, it looks like. How do y'all feel about... Sauerkraut. Is that a favorite food of yours? Or, uh, here in the States, we eat cabbage, a uh, fried cabbage, uh, with uh, Polish sausage. It's a, that's a thing we eat. Um, okay. So I didn't, let's see. Before milking prized cow. Okay, go across the river. So first of all, I need to find the bridge, which is down here. Potatoes boiled in apple juice. You know, I've never done that. I bet it's good. Let's see, the bridge is over here. There's something about the scale here that throws me off, too. I can also click on the mini-map. I need to get used to that. Aha, here's some cows. Now I need to find a milkmaid. There's a milkmaid. Gilly Groats. Uh, I guess I should go through the gate. Shouldn't I? Wait a minute. What does this say? Read the signpost. Local cow herders have reported that 1,738 cows have been slain in this field today by passing adventurers. Farmers throughout the land fear this may be an epidemic. I, I would imagine probably so. Just my guess. I live on a farm, grew up on a farm, and... Um, close the gate after yourself is basically gospel. Favorite pizza? I like uh, Supreme Pizza. Pizza with everything. Uh Pepperoni, green peppers, red onions, um, Italian sausage, and of course mozzarella. Hello, I'm Gilly. What can I do for you? I'm after some top quality milk. Really? Is it for something special? I don't know if she sounds like this at all. Most certainly, it's for the cook to make a cake for Duke Horacio. Well, it's quite an honor you'd pick my cows. I'd suggest you get some milk from my prized cow. Which one's that? She's on the east side of the field by the cliff. Be gentle. Okay. Taco pizza? Yeah, I've never had a taco pizza. Chicken Alfredo pizza? There's a, uh, a restaurant not too far from me called Pizza King. Um... It's a, it's a tiny little local chain. This is it. 
I say chain. There's two of them. And um, it's locally owned. And they have a really good white chicken pizza, which is very much like chicken alfredo. It's very good. Uh, we don't have a pot. We don't have a pot to put the milk in. Did it not say that we could get that here? Uh, here. Empty. Oh, bucket. We need the pot for the flour. We need the bucket for the milk. My mistake. Let us find a bucket. I wish you could do like you, you can in Baldur's Gate and hold down... What is it? Control or something? I can't remember which button it is. You can hold it down and it will highlight everything. It did say that the buckets would be nearby. Where, oh where. I hope you can't hear that. There, There's someone outside making a lot of noise. Um, well, let's see. I thought I looked, but maybe I did not. Maybe they're too small. Maybe she'll say something about it. Can you tell me how to milk a cow? Empty bucket. You can buy empty buckets from the general store in Lumbridge. Or you can buy them. You could... You look like you could do with an empty bucket. Here, take this spare one. Okay. There we go. We got it. We, we got it. We're good. I understand. I got it. Prized dairy cow. Oh! Oh! How stupid, there's a bucket right there. How did I not... How did I not see that? Okay, good. I'm glad you don't hear it, HP. I'm, I have noise filters on, but... You yeah, know. Okay, I've got everything. I've got the super large egg, I've got the flour, and I've got the milk. So what I'm going to do now is just... Uh, Go to the lodestone. Yeah. Sometimes, though, I, it, it, <laughs> things can be right in front of your face. And you know what's funny? Before I actually did YouTube content, uh, I would watch other people doing Let's Plays or streams or whatever. And um, they would talk about how... Like, they, they just don't see things. You know, like, it, it could be right on the screen and... They just won't see it. I think the cook was in here. And I thought, you know, how can you be so blind? Is that like what? But there's something about when you do these videos, your brain is engaged with the game in a different way. And um, some a lot of things could be right in front of my face and I just don't see them. Because I'm thinking about talking to y'all. Or trying to sound clever. <laughs> Which sometimes can be a challenge. Uh, how are you getting on with finding the ingredient? I think we have everything. Give the milk. Here's some top quality milk. Fine flour. Super large egg. You brought me everything. I am saved. Thank you. So do I get to go to the Duke's party? I'm afraid not. Only the big cheeses get to dine with the Duke. And we are definitely not a big cheese. Maybe one day I'll be important enough to sit at the Duke's table. Maybe, but I wouldn't be holding my breath. Gee, thanks. Huzzah! You completed Cook's Assistant. You were awarded one quest point. 300 cooking XP. 500 coins, 20 sardines. Access to the Cook's range. Nice. Two treasure hunter keys. Yeah, it is. It is you know, when you're focused on... It's almost like your brain is on autopilot as far as the game is concerned, especially since I've been gaming since the early 80s. And my mind is somewhere else. So this game, being an MMO, is a totally new paradigm for me. And I cannot autopilot it. 
You know what I mean? Uh, thank you, Robert. That is a great tip. Thank you so much. Okay. So now we we could go do those um, sheep, I guess. Indeed, it is complete. I feel good. Set it active. Quest overview. We have to make balls of black wool, right? That That's what we do. Talk to Fred. Did we not? Uh... All right. So we just need to. Thank you, Robert. That's awesome. Thank you so much. I, I think. All right. Let us see. I think we just go back there and shear sheep for him, right? The black ones. I'm not sure why it's not on the quest log. Cool. I'm glad to know that is a, a good rule of thumb. Thank you, Robert. Because I need, Lord knows I need, look there's someone running around, looks like uh, Santa Claus. A little bitty Santa Claus, that's cute. Okay. I'm going to talk to the farmer again. There he is. I, I didn't mean to close the door. Talk to Fred. Um, how many more balls of wool? 20. I know, I don't have any. At least I haven't been eaten. Yes. That is a good thing. So we need black balls of wool. Where's the gate? Oh, climb over. Yeah. We used to have these... On our fences back in the day. Sheer sheep. Yeah, I love the I love the sheep shearing animation. That's just a lamb there. Sheer sheep. Nice. It's a good thing they uh, grow their wool back pretty quick, you know. Yeah, there, there are some pretty satisfying animations in this game. So this 10, this 10. Oh, that's for our uh, Slayer quest. I get too excited here. Oh, yeah. I wish shearing sheep was this easy in real life. You gotta wrestle them. Have any of y'all ever sheared a sheep? Goat man, you ever sheared a sheep? Uh, let's see. Oh, the black one is hiding over there. Oh no, the sheep got away from me. Okay, I'm gonna sure. I'm gonna I'm gonna write that down, Robert. Let me write that down. I do have a notebook going for this game. All right, this will fill up our um fill up our inventory. So now we need to go and spin this. Okay, thanks, Tony. Was there a spinning wheel inside the guy's house? That'd be too much to ask for, right?
I'm just gonna go through your stuff. I hope you don't mind. It would be strange to keep a spinning wheel in the bedroom. Unless you're a sleeping beauty, of course. No spinning wheel. So, wait a minute. Let me ask him again. How to get balls of wood. A wool. Spin it on a spinning wheel, right. The nearest spinning wheel can be found on the first floor of Lumbridge Castle. Okay. So I need to dump some inventory. That's what I need to do. But let's go ahead and, and refresh my memory here and do some spinning. The castle is this way. This way to the castle. He did say the first floor of the castle. I tell you, my short-term memory is crap. Okay. Another thing that is a great challenge for me is... Uh, can you just go up this ladder? I have a fairly severe ADHD, which... Uh, is uh, this is going in the tower? This is not what we want. Inside the castle. Okay. Whoops. Sorry. In we go. We go up this staircase. Is it downstairs? Hello, SR2008 RS. It's in a bedroom. After I made that wise crack about, uh, yeah. <laughs> After I made that wise crack about the uh, spinning wheel being in the bedroom, that's hilarious. Thank you. Thank you both. <laughs> Good to have you in the stream, SR2008. Thanks for joining us. Alrighty. So, we now have a 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 uh, things. Black wool, we need 20 altogether. Let's go down the stairs. I'll bet you there's a bank somewhere near here. There's a bank above me. Top of the castle, thank you. Heroes of Might and Magic. That is a is a goodie. That is a goodie. I haven't played any of those games in forever. I was real big into. I uh, can't pick that up. I was real big into. Um. There's one. Uh, wizardry also back in the day. Here we go. So just put some of this stuff in there. I'm going to keep a couple of my chickens. I don't know. I, I doubt I'm going to need them, but... These sardines. Uh, let's throw them in. And deposit the raw crayfish. Why not? 
All righty. Well, I can understand why. It's pretty convenient. Go down. And I think what we will do is get some more wool. And we'll probably wrap this up. Uh, we'll wrap up this little mini quest. And that will be the end of the stream. I do have to go deal with some termites. Isn't that fun? But um, I do have a few more minutes here. There we go. Here's our black friends. Bye. Yeah, we actually got something done today. Isn't that great? It's a good feeling. Haha, <laughs> thanks. Thanks, Robert. I'm glad you could make it today, too. Oh, I love how fast the wool grows back. Nice. Oh no, I got away. Yes. How true. Yes. Big W today. The Woolage. W for win, W for wool. It's just, it's all W's everywhere. Boom, boom, boom. Let's get it. Yeah. Thanks for the cheers, guys. Appreciate it. Let us go. And get us a sheep. I guess I'll just fill my inventory up with this. And, and uh, then go back. So we have, let's see, that's a five, eight. We have more than enough, right? I think. Uh, that's a good question, HP. I'm thinking, uh, how, well, first of all, how familiar am I with it? A little bit familiar vis-a-vis -vis playing Fallout 3 recently. And I did play a little bit of New Vegas back in the day. I got not very far, though, before, you know, life got in the way. I, I got to the town of Prim and did a few things in there. And that was about it. As far as the build goes, not sure yet. That's something I definitely want to uh, talk about with chat when we do that. Oh, my inventory's full. Okay. Now it's time to go back. Would it be faster to walk or just... Tell no, wrong place. Oops. 20? Yeah. Yeah, I think, especially since I uh, <laughs> warped to the wrong place. How stupid. You, you come for the intelligence, right? I just like playing with the teleporter, right? <laughs> uh, okay. You're right. I could have just used the one there. I need to make the balls first. Wait, where's the castle? Why am I so confused? Uh, here's the castle. No, there's the castle. It is to the west. Right here. Or this is the wall. Yeah, here's the castle. Okay. I'm I swear, I'm 
I don't need a brain transplant. I just act like I do on TV. Oh, I'm sure it will. There we go. Spinning wheel. Thanks for the vote of confidence. Huh? Yeah. I one of the the things that the thing that will help me is when I get some time to play this game off camera and I get and I can just totally focus on it. I was planning on doing that yesterday and life got in the way. See ya, HP. Thanks for coming. Alrighty. So let's go back to the farmer. You too, my friend. Uh, hopefully I'll see you tomorrow night. Go down. Actually, I can close this quest thing. Go back to the farmer. Give him his 20 balls of wool. And then we'll call it a day. Or today. Someone left the gate open. Was it me? I don't know. I love how all these NPCs have little tongue-in-cheek things to say about, uh, you know, the players. I have some balls of black wool. Give them here, then. That's the last of them. Pleasure doing business with you. You can shear my sheep whenever you want. You can even sell the wool in the Grand Exchange. But that's the white ones only, mind you. Anyways, I guess I better pay you. Nice. That is a good feeling. I love the little seal. RS. <laughs> yes. Crafting level 5. Thank you, Tony. All right, and I think that's a good place to call it a stream. Thanks, Tony. Thanks, SR2008, Goatman, and of course, HP. I think you're already gone, but thank you. And Robert. I could never forget Robert. And Philippe, if you're still here, thank you for joining me as well. Let me see. Is that everybody? I believe it is. I believe it is. Goatman. Thanks to each and every one of you for joining me today. Uh, we'll get a longer stream going one of these days. Stay uh, up on the channel, uh, on the community tab. I'll post updates. And as soon as I have a time that will definitely work to stream, I will go ahead and schedule it. So you'll be able to, to um, get notifications on it. So it'll be under my channel, under the live tab. Uh, if you look there, we'll be streaming again tomorrow night at 8 p.m. Eastern. We'll be doing Fallout New Vegas and talking about the Fallout TV show. So if that's your cup of tea, I'll be glad to have you back. And uh, like the video if you uh, liked it. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please consider doing so because your support means everything to me. And I really appreciate each and every one of you. I hope you have a great day. And I'll see you again real soon. Bye-bye.